Here at home now, a dry cleaning service in Malden shut down abruptly. Some customers said they lost their money and their clothes. Our Rashad Williams has this story that you will see only on WYFF News 4. So I'm standing right in front of One Price Dry Cleaning in Malden, and let me show you, the doors are now locked. Malden PD has shut the place down, but earlier this morning there were people inside. It was chaos. They were trying to find their clothes, and some tell me that they've been using this service for many years, and they were never told ahead of time that the dry cleaning service would be closed. But I'm going to show you inside. There are still clothes hanging up. We popped by One Price Dry Cleaning on Friday around 10 a.m. That, that's not right. As soon as we got there, so did Malden PD. There's people in their merchandise is missing, damaged, has not been cleaned. A sign on the front door read, this business is permanently closed. Customers can pick up on 1118 from 9 to 12. Items not picked up will be donated. That's a short window for everybody to, to come get their clothes and you see the mess of this. Inside was a free-for-all. You have a ticket number. But the numbers are all mixed up on the hangers. No, it's just a sport coat. No pants. It was brand new. He didn't even wear it. I brought four in, got one back. I'm missing five pair of pants. But everyone was still getting charged. Well, I ain't paying for them. I, 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 I'm, getting, I'm getting mine and going out that door. Because I'm not paying for them. Because that's not right. However, we saw the owner of the building, not the business, collecting money from people. Malden PD questioned him. Are you still requiring Ooh, payment? Work for it? Yeah, they're, they're, they're paying. Yeah, they're yeah, paying. But why are we, pay, we paying you? You ain't done nothing, why are we paying him? He tells Malden PD the owner of the shop was recently evicted. He's taking money from the customers <laughs> to recoup his bills that the man left him. Man, I don't know what my stuff is. Would you like to comment on what's going on right now? No. After declining to comment, the building owner kicked us out. Hello. And Malden PD decided to kick everyone else out as well around 11, an hour before the pickup cutoff. Because we can't find the business owner right now, we've been advised to shut it down for now. According to the Secretary of State website, one price has been operating without a proper license since September of 2010. So after Malden PD cleared the building, they locked the doors, people were still showing up in the parking lot. We still have people showing up right now, looking at the building, wondering if they can get inside to get their clothes. We overheard Malden PD telling everyone that they would now have to file a civil lawsuit in order to get their clothes back. In Malden, Rashad Williams, WIFF News 4.